This is my review of two tactical pens I bought from GearBest.com. This is my first purchase from GearBest. The prices were excellent. The website was also excellent. My only negative about the buying experience was the ship time. I chose the free shipping option for my purchase and the two pens took over a month to arrive. My recommendation would be to allow for a long ship time or purchase expedited shipping. The first pen is the LAIX B8. It is all aluminum construction with a pull-off cap. I paid about $5 for it. I like that the cap fits on the top while writing. The point at the top is definitely sharp. The pen seems to write adequately. Here's the pen disassembled. I am assuming refills are readily available. I was impressed with how much of the top of the pen is solid aluminum. This gives the pen a nice weight and solid feel. The second pen is the LAIX B007. It cost about a dollar more than the first pen. The cap screws off of this pen. It is advertised as having a tungsten steel tip at the top. This pen seems to write just as well as the first one. Here's the pen disassembled. It is very similar in construction to the first pen. This pen also has a thick solid aluminum section at the top. I thought I would try stabbing some homebrew ballistics gelatin. I used a thin piece of cotton flannel to simulate clothing. This is the B8 with a sharp aluminum tip. Ouch! That's going to leave a mark. Next is the B007 with the tungsten tip. No hole in the flannel. Let me take another stab at it. Still no hole. Here's a comparison of what the two pens were able to do. I was surprised that the tungsten tip did not pierce the fabric. The next test is a piece of one inch pine. I tried to stab about as hard as I did on the first test. Here's close up photos of the mark each pen made in the pine. I decided to test the B007 tungsten tip on a tempered glass pie plate. I think my wife is going to need a new one. As a worst case test, I tried stabbing a steel plate with both pens. The tip of the B8 was flattened with no mark in the steel. The tungsten tip on the B007 put a divot in the steel with no visible damage to the tip. I was even able to use the tungsten tip to write on the steel. Pretty impressive. After all of this abuse, both pens seem to write as well as they did straight out of the box. Aside from the long ship time, my GearBest buying experience was good. Both pens seemed to be good quality. I was impressed with the tungsten tip on the B007 and I was able to easily resharpen the damage point on the B8. Thanks for watching.